smokes. I'm probably gonna have a black eye tomorrow. I don't know. We're gonna go try to find things and figure it out. We've got pants on and everything, so. Just got to our place. It's the cutest place ever. I honestly didn't even expect this. Let me give you guys a little house tour. Hey guys, what's up? It is a new day. We do not have any makeup on and our pimples are still in full effect. But today I'm actually going snowboarding. I'm just about to pick up my friend and then we'll head over. Originally going to do Summit, but apparently everything is closed on the one day that I want to go snowboarding. And so we're actually going to Stevens Pass, which is a little bit further. Oh, no, 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 no. We're going to Crystal. I'm getting confused. Um, we're going to Crystal, so hopefully it turns out okay. I've actually never snowboarded in my life and I'm not that athletic, so I'm low-key borderline scared. But we'll see how this turns out <laughs> overall I'm excited um, if there's any time in my life that I'm gonna learn how to snowboard it's definitely when I'm still in my 20s with amazing joints so yeah we're gonna give it a shot um, I used to do gymnastics as a kid so I mean hopefully I have some sort of balance left I'm not very good at skateboarding so I heard that's kind of the precursor you know wow this temperature is really high I need to actually just turn this down as you guys can see, I am in Kevin's car because my car is not a four-wheel drive, so I can't take it to the mountains. So thank you so much to Kevin for letting me borrow Carby because I need her. <laughs> okay, um, I actually have so much work to get done, so I need to get that done on the car ride there. Of course, we are getting McDonald's, and this is what we're having for breakfast, but I honestly haven't had the hash brown in forever, so. Why is there a little spot? Is that from the camera? I need to clean the lens. Okay guys, getting ready to go. I've got my, it's actually really cute under the beanie, but cute little hairband and two braids, popping the beanie on. And then now I gotta pop my snowboard pants on. Got these at Costco in the girls section. They're like only 20 bucks. So hopefully they end up being okay. I mean, they're probably supposed to be tight. Like, I don't really know, you know? I'm gonna bring you guys on the GoPro instead of the vlog camera because I'm definitely going to break the vlog camera if I bring that. Am I supposed to tuck my shirt in? Low key, kinda lost, but we're gonna go try to find things and figure it out. We've got pants on and everything, so. Here's the can water that we're drinking. Um, these rugs are from Mike Hellman's, but overall, feeling better. I um, was hoping to vlog and show you guys us snowboarding, but we're literally so bad that there's like nothing to film. So uh, maybe a little bit later, but we're feeling a little bit better. Like at least we can like kind of go down the slopes now. So just, uh, just taking it step by step. All right, guys, it is, it looks like it's like midnight, but it's actually only 5 p.m. Uh, we are just heading over to our cute little cabin, but before then, we honestly haven't eaten anything since that McDonald's this morning. I had a little bit of some Kit Kats and things like that, so I'm really hungry. Getting some teriyaki from nearby and then we'll head back. Our options are pretty limited because there's only like 10 places to eat here and half of them are closed. Okay, just got to our place. It's the cutest place ever. I honestly didn't even expect this. Holy crap. Let me give you guys a little house tour. This is what the kitchen looks like. Super shiny and white. Here's the teriyaki that I'm having for dinner. Coming over to the living room. Oh my gosh, this place is so, oh my god, I almost died. Um, this place is so cute. Holy smokes. Okay, going up the stairs. You guys are seeing the first look with me. Here's bedroom number one. Looks like a king size bed. There's a little couch. Super cute. And then bathroom number, bathroom number one? I don't know. I haven't seen the bathroom yet. Super, super cute with a nice bathtub. And then bedroom number two. This is what I want my house to look like. And uh, I guess we're just not there yet in life, but this is so cute. Wow, 
smacked myself in the eye with the tripod. Oh my god, I can feel a bump. Smokes. I'm probably gonna have a black eye tomorrow. I don't know. Loki hurts. We'll evaluate the situation tomorrow. So Mama Rai texted me and she said that I should start uh, integrating. Oh my God, these stairs are gonna kill me. Let me set you guys down in a good spot so I don't have to hold you. Okay, Mama Rai texted me and said that I should start integrating a nice little motivational pep talk or something at the end of my vlogs, which honestly, I'm all for. But today was a big day for me because I was snowboarding and it was the first time ever that I had snowboarded in my life. I had skied a couple of times before but honestly, I'm not very good at skiing either. It's honestly interesting because I felt like growing up I was pretty athletic, but then if I actually think about the individual sports, I don't feel like I was ever good at anything. I'm just a very, very fast runner, and so I think people perceive me to be athletic. Um, skiing has never been that much fun because I am always face planting into the snow constantly. And I thought, you know, I live in freaking Seattle. If I don't snowboard now, I really don't see when I would ever snowboard. And so I feel like if, if I'm going to learn how to snowboard, it needs to be while I'm still 23 and young and my joints are healthy. And so we gave it a shot. Um, it's kind of a spontaneous decision, but I mean, I don't know what to say. The first couple of rounds, I mean, we did, so we went to Crystal and there was a, a little discovery portion and Honestly, there were so many people who were such beginners trying to learn how to go down this tiny slope that I wasn't even concerned about learning how to snowboard. There were just so many people. I was so scared that I was going to hurt someone else while I was learning. And so that just totally wasn't the mood. We were just like, okay, should we just like go on the real slopes? Like whatever, like if we fall, we fall, but like at least we can try to learn. And so the first time we went down, oh my God, I thought I was going to die. <laughs> I literally thought I was going to die. Like couldn't get a grip, couldn't get anything, like just... Like, I think the thing with snowboarding is that stopping is so difficult. It's such an art. You have to know the right amount of force and pressure in order to stop without falling on your face. Um, so that took some time to figure out, but by like the, I don't know, third or fourth run, things started to feel a lot, lot better. And am I still falling every 30 seconds? Definitely, but I mean, I just feel like I kind of got the hang of it. And if anything, this is my first time snowboarding. So I feel like I need to be forgiving of myself. And I feel like I did a pretty okay job. Like there were some, 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 you know, nice runs where I was actually able to break like appropriately, which I was just like, wish I got that on camera because you know, be proud. But I mean, I, it's interesting because I feel like when I watch all the kids who are snowboarding and skiing and they seem to not have nearly as much fear of, you know, trying new things and being judged by other people. And I just feel like I'm so conscious. I'm like, oh my God, is anyone watching me? Do they think I'm stupid? Do they think I'm dumb? Like, you know, can I do this? Like, should I just not do it because it's so scary? And I feel like that doesn't go through any kid's mind. Like they're just there to have fun and do the best that they can. And I don't know, that's the kind of mentality that I need to re-adapt in my life. I feel like as an adult, we're so often scared to take risks that you know you will get hurt from, but sometimes you have to have a little bit of rain before there's, you know, sunshine and rainbows. Fell a lot, <laughs> definitely gonna be in grave pain tomorrow from all the exercise. I had a ton of fun. I can't say that this is something I would probably want to do all the time, but I'm sure once a once a winter, it would be so, so much fun. And honestly, I think I like snowboarding better than I like skiing. That's that. I will see you guys tomorrow for another vlog. Don't forget that you're a 10 out of 10. Don't let anyone ever make you feel otherwise. If you watch this video in its entirety, honestly, I am so proud of you. If you made it this far, then leave a comment down below and tell me what your favorite part of this entire vlogmas series was or your favorite part of this video and i will see you guys tomorrow